And News on Six's Tatum Gwynn is covering the other side of this race. She is with Joy Hoffmeister's campaign, and Tatum is also here in Oklahoma City. Hey, Tatum. Hey, Jonathan, you know, State Superintendent Hoffmeister is entering Election Day with a lot of momentum behind her campaign. She really entered this race at an interesting position. We know Hoffmeister has been a lifelong Republican, but changed her party affiliation last year so that she could challenge Governor Stitt. And she's been able to garner support from a lot of groups that have largely felt unsupported by the governor. Now, because of Hoffmeister's background and professional career dedicated to education, she's She's been able to round up support from teachers. She's also been able to reach out to tribal nations, bolstering an endorsement from the state's five largest tribes, a first of its kind endorsement. She says her success thus far has been because she's running for people, not any one label or any one party. This is about um, putting people over politics. So I'm not looking at labels, but I do believe that it is important that uh, someone like me, who's an independent thinker, aggressively moderate, uh, will say, meet me in the middle and let's get something done for the people of Oklahoma. Now we are just hours away from seeing if that momentum is enough to push past her challenger. Our watch party starts tonight at 6.30. We are live in Oklahoma City. I'm Tatum Gwynn, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.